uh, ever wondered about the physical changes that can occur after a long-term narcissistic abuse? This is a topic that isn't discussed often enough, but it's incredibly important. Narcissistic abuse, a form of emotional and psychological manipulation, doesn't just affect the mind, it can also leave a profound impact on the body. The constant emotional toll, the stress of living in a state of hypervigilance, it all adds up and can manifest in a variety of physical symptoms. These changes can be subtle, almost imperceptible, or they can be significant and deeply troubling. And they differ from person to person, shaped by individual experiences and coping mechanisms. From chronic stress-related ailments to digestive issues and even changes in appearance, the long-term physical effects of narcissistic abuse can be far-reaching. So, what exactly are these physical changes? How do they manifest? Let's delve into these physical changes, starting with the effects of chronic stress. Living under constant stress can trigger a range of physical issues. This is especially true when you're dealing with a narcissistic personality in your life. You see, chronic stress is like a silent alarm that never shuts off, causing your body to be in a constant state of high alert. And this constant state of high alert can lead to a multitude of physical manifestations. One of the first places we see the impact is the immune system. When you're under chronic stress, your body pumps out stress hormones that suppress your immune system. This leaves you more susceptible to illnesses and infections, as your body's natural defenses are busy dealing with the stress response rather than protecting you from external threats. Next, let's talk about energy levels. The emotional and mental drain of dealing with a narcissist can leave you feeling like a wind-up toy that's lost its spring. You may find yourself constantly fatigued, exhausted, and running on empty no matter how much rest you get. Chronic stress also has a knack for manifesting in physical ways, leading to headaches, muscle tension, and other aches and pains. These symptoms can be your body's way of signaling that it's under too much stress and needs a break. Then there are the sleep disturbances, Difficulty falling asleep, staying asleep, or experiencing nightmares can become all too common. This is due to the anxiety and hypervigilance caused by ongoing narcissistic abuse. Your mind is always on guard, even when you're trying to rest, leading to disrupted sleep patterns. It's important to remember that these are just some of the ways that chronic stress from narcissistic abuse can manifest physically. Each person's experience will be unique and symptoms can vary widely. But understanding the connection between these symptoms and the ongoing stress of dealing with a narcissist is a crucial step in recognizing the impact of chronic stress on your physical health. Now that we've covered the impact of chronic stress, let's move on to digestive issues. The stress and emotional turmoil of narcissistic abuse can wreak havoc on your digestive system. This is because our bodies and minds are intricately connected and emotional distress can disrupt the normal functioning of our digestive systems. Let's start with common symptoms like stomach upset, nausea, and diarrhea. These can be responses to the chronic stress and anxiety experienced in an abusive relationship. You might notice that your stomach feels constantly unsettled, or that you often feel nauseous or bloated. Next, let's talk about appetite. It's not uncommon for people under chronic stress to experience changes in their eating habits. Some people might lose their appetite altogether, while others might find themselves eating more, often craving unhealthy comfort foods. This is a way of coping with the stress, but it can also lead to other health problems down the line. Acid reflux and heartburn are other potential issues. The constant state of stress can cause an overproduction of stomach acid, leading to these uncomfortable symptoms. If you already suffer from these conditions, you might find that they get worse during periods of heightened stress or anxiety. Remember, these are all potential symptoms. Not everyone will experience them, and their severity can vary from person to person. If you're dealing with any of these issues, it's important to seek medical attention. From our stomachs, let's move on to other physical changes that can occur. Narcissistic abuse can lead to a wide array of other physical changes. Let's delve a bit deeper into what some of these might be. Firstly, one might notice significant weight fluctuations. The constant stress and emotional turmoil can lead to changes in eating habits, resulting in either weight gain or loss. 
This could be due to loss of appetite or conversely, an increased craving for comfort foods as a coping mechanism. Next, let's talk skin. Stress is a common trigger for skin conditions like acne, eczema, and others. The emotional strain coupled with a weakened immune system can result in these conditions worsening. Sexual dysfunction is another potential physical change. This could take the form of a loss of libido, difficulty achieving orgasm, or even pain during sex. These symptoms can be directly linked to the emotional and psychological trauma caused by the abuse. Finally, hair loss or thinning may occur. This can be quite alarming, but it's important to remember that chronic stress can indeed trigger such changes. The physical changes from narcissistic abuse can be diverse and vary greatly in severity from person to person. They are deeply personal and can be quite distressing. However, it's crucial to remember these changes are not permanent. With professional help, you can address the underlying emotional trauma, which in turn aids in healing the physical symptoms. Remember, these changes are not permanent and there is help available. To sum up, the physical changes after narcissistic abuse can be alarming, but they're not insurmountable. We've discussed how chronic stress can lead to a weakened immune system, fatigue, headaches, muscle tension, and sleep disturbances. We've also explored how emotional turmoil may disrupt your digestive system, leading to stomach upset, appetite changes, acid reflux, and heartburn. Other potential physical changes include weight fluctuations, skin problems, sexual dysfunction, and even hair loss. It's crucial to remember that these are potential effects and not everyone will experience all of them. The severity and specific manifestations will vary depending on individual factors and the nature of the abuse. If you're experiencing any concerning physical changes, don't hesitate to seek medical attention. And let's not forget, these changes while distressing are not permanent. With proper care, support, and attention to the underlying emotional trauma, healing is possible. Prioritize your well-being, seek professional support if needed, and focus on healing both your body and mind. You are not alone in this journey.